Today I'm going to do a walkthrough on how to install a Ethernet cable or LAN cable into your inverter, uh, especially the Solar Edge inverter. Pretty much they are almost all the same on any type of inverter. They all come with the LAN interface built in inside the inverter. We just need to open the box. One of the reasons why I changed my inverter to the LAN because the uh, real-time data transfer. Not many of you guys might know that most of the inverter come with a cell um, uh, card that built in that the data plan that your contractor they bought it for you when they installed the inverter. Usually the data plan come out of five years or twelve years. After that, you cannot monitor your inverter unless you extending the uh, data plan. So by changing to LAN, first of all, it's free. There, there's, an, there's no cost associated to it. As long as you have internet connection, your inverter is transferred the data to the server for free. And it's real time, where the cell signal, it only transfer every four hours and only a snapshot of 15 minutes of your data. So technically, it's not a real time. If you do like via LAN or via Wi-Fi, it's a real time, it's free. So I encourage you guys to look into that if you have a so have an inverter like a solar edge or any other type of manufacturers. They all come with the LAN interface. So I'm gonna do a, a walkthrough on how to uh, hook up the LAN cable and how to set it up. Um, the inverter to the LAN monitoring by changing the interface, by changing the configuration once the cable is running. Alright, stay tuned. Good. Undo all the screw. Undo all this screw. Undo all. Stay there. Stay there. So, this is the Ethernet cord right there. The bottom. Now we put them back together. Screw them back in. So once you get all the cable hooked up, you need to go into your inverter settings and change the communication to LAN or Wi-Fi, depending on which one you prefer. So to do that, you hold on the OK button for 3 seconds. It will prompt for the password. The password is 123-123-12, just like in this sequence. All right, now you in, so you just na navigate down to communication, press OK. You see where it says right now, it says server itself. You want to go in there, hit OK, change it to LAN or the other Wi-Fi, but we're going to change to LAN. Server channel select is LAN, so now you, the server is changing to LAN, see that? So now go hit back. So now, once you change it, when you're going back, if you go just press the down button, you're going to see that your inverter communicating in via LAN. So you just press down until you see where it says server is LAN is OK. Status 11111 is OK. So that's it. That's pretty much how you change your inverter setting from, from sales to LAN.